Hey there, everybody. What's going on here? How about we just... Peace, bitch! Well, alright. That was quite the cutscene. For 2004 GameCube, that's not that bad. So, everybody, welcome back to my newest Let's Play. Custom Robo. I've been waving this game around for a really long time. While teasing you guys with it. Withing it? Withing it! No, with it! For a good long time now. So it's about time I got started. So, here we go. We got the modes here. We got story mode. Arcade mode. Versus mode. <laughs> Options, who cares. And parts index. Well, that's... I'll talk about that later. So, this is story mode. We're gonna start with that. And, uh... Oh. <laughs> Alright, I guess we'll start a uh, new file. And yeah, there are actually two story modes in this game, but the Grand Battle is not really, like, a normal story mode. I'll talk about that later. So we'll do a new journey map. And what's this? The hell? What's wrong with their voices? Sound like they're talking through a pillow. You know, since there's no voice acting in this game, I'm thinking about uh, taking on the voices. Like, actually doing voice acting. I don't know. Alright, maybe I'll start the voice acting after this cutscene. Dad! Oh, wait, that's not good. Aww, he remembered our birth. Ooh, it's a watch. What does a little kid want with a watch? It's a very special watch, son. Ooh, a special watch. Well, we'll learn about that later, too. Aww, this is sad. Well, especially the music in the background, you know. Uh-huh. 
Dad's gotta go. Wake up and get out of bed. Oh shit. Honest, just cause you don't work doesn't mean you can sleep your day away. Do you even know what time it is? It's past noon. Don't you have a job interview? What was that place again? Stale horse? You need that job if you're gonna pay your rent. Now get up and get that job. You heard. Get out of bed and drag your lazy behind to stay a horse interview. So I go from an Italian woman to a southern woman. I don't know. Jeez, good morning to you too. It's not stale horse, it's steel heart. <laughs> Whatever. Just get up and get out of bed. You need that job. Oh, and good luck. Yeah, that's right, bitch. Get out of my house. So as you can probably tell, she's our landlady. Oh, and this is us, if you couldn't figure it out. Now that! That's a good way to get dressed. Oh, man. So here we are. This is uh, this is our main character. We'll name him soon. And we got some uh, cool stuff here. I'm not going to talk about what this stuff is until uh, we actually get to it. And yeah, like I said, I'm going to do the voice acting. For the most part. Well, look at you, all gussied up and ready to go. Now don't you come back here without a job. I've been worried about you, and not just because of the rent, you know. You were worried about me? Well, we've all been worried. Not a single word from your father for years, and then that letter comes. It must have been a terrible shock to find out about his death like that. Just a letter and a will. Telling me to become a robo commander. I know it's weird, but I hadn't seen him for so long. In fact, the only thing I really remember about my dad is the watch again. I don't remember anything else, but that's beside the point. I need to worry about the future now. That's certainly true. You've been living off your family savings for years. It's about time you got a job. Yeah, we're just lazy bone. I'll do my best, in fact. I'll do whatever it takes to become a commander. So we'll find all about this robo stuff and these commander stuff and what all this stuff is soon, trust me. And the gameplay, we'll explain that too. Just wait on it, please. That's what your father wanted, isn't it? At least that's what's in his will. You're a good boy. You could go for any job you wanted, but you don't want to let your father down. Yeah, I wonder why my dad wanted me. Why did my dad want me to become a commander? How oh, good. I don't know why it was so important to him, but I ought to give it a shot. I'd like to see his last wish fulfilled. The commander, huh? Yeah, I can do it. Yeah, so, uh, what's a commander do? A commander is a person who controls a custom robo. Oh boy. We'll figure that out too, don't worry. Hmm, no, I'm afraid I'm just not following you. Anyway, don't just think of me as a landlady. Think of me as a friend. If you need any advice, just ask. Thanks. 
well then, you go get that job and become a command at Stale Horse. It's not Stale Horse! I'll do my best. Bye. Alright, it's time to go. Let's go get our job at Stale Horse. So yes, this is an overhead uh, screen where we're going to see all the locations of the game that we can go to. More will become available to us right now, and actually I'm not controlling this. But uh, normally you do control it and choose where you want to go. So here we are at Stale Horse. I mean Steel Horse. Who's this guy? What? What are you? Oh right, you're here for the interview. You see that scary looking guy over there? He's the guy you want to talk to. He's the boss. <laughs> the arrow over his head is uh, very helpful. So you're here for the interview? Right. Let's get this over with. You ever worked as a bounty hunter before? Err. Err, I think I have. Yeah, I'm almost positive. Almost. Huh? Hey, what's with the vague answer? You either did or you didn't. Look, forget it. Moving on, next question. You got a robo? Uh, which, yes, it's one of those things where you can choose your answers and it's funny. I can't afford it. Mm, yeah, well, I guess that's why you're here, huh? To get a job, make some cash. You look dirt poor. Oh, this is poor as our offices. Oh, this guy. Hey, enough out of you. You're no Mr. Moneybag yourself. Ha! Ah, this hairy guy. Anyway, I'm sorry, but I need an experienced guy with his own robo. I just can't afford to hire an amateur. What are you talking about? I can't afford to hire anyone who's not an amateur. Oh. Besides, I'm sick of being a new guy. We got someone I can push around. He's a dick. I'm sick of dealing with a chief on my own. You got something to say? Listen, even if we did hire you, we don't have a robo to spare, so you'll need to get one somewhere. I gotta make a good impression. What should I say? <laughs> oh, come on. Why would I pick anything else? I'm a good cook. Which is actually not. Oh, great. I'll tell you what we're going after the sinister spatula and his big sale bandits. None of this really matters, though. The simple fact is we don't have the money to buy you a robo. And so that's why I can't hire you. Aw, uh, but we really need some fresh blood around here, Chief. We got too much work and not enough people. Can't we get an old Junker Robo for him to use? You don't pay the bills around here. Sorry, pal. You look nice enough, but you might as well forget it. Whoa! We've got a call. Maybe it's a job. I don't know why Harry's voice is changing, but... Steel Hearts, your one-stop bounty hunting shop. This is Ernest. Ah, how are you today? You're sounding lovely as usual. Lovely? What, is that a woman? Chief, have you got a girl? Shut up, you! Ah. <laughs> huh? Oh, yeah. Yeah, of course. No, we'll be as, uh... Uh-huh. Yeah, right. Got it. Yes, understood. I'll send some right away. We've got work, Harry. Standard burglary. And the police squad's fighting them now. Aw, oh, man. I don't want to go if the police squad's gonna be there. By the way, who just called? Shut your gap and get going. Head out to the research lab. Quest comes from the lab director. Linda, woohoo! I'll go, I'll go. Leave it to me. Oh, and Harry, take the kid with you. 
Once he sees what a real fight looks like, he'll tuck his tail between his legs and run home. What? Ah, oh, man. Alright, come on. Just don't get in the way. Yeah, whatever. Harry. It looks like he just took a dump. Ah, whatever. He walks like that through the entire game, so this doesn't really matter. You get used to it. That was Linda. She's the director of the Robo Research Lab. As in, we're going there. Great. Fantastic. She's really gorgeous. I don't know why I was talking about her for a second. I can't Smart and compassionate, really. She's the perfect match for me. Alright, I think this is the perfect place to end the video, so, uh, we'll see you guys next time for Custom Robo. Bye.